Hey guys, Jay Nassi here. What is up guys? It's 113 and 6 gameplay. It's a subscriber challenge. If you guys don't know what that is, is that means uh, a subscriber left a comment on my page saying to get an attack 45, 100 plus with no swarm, no dogs, no load star, no warship. I can use the escort drone and the warthog and that's exactly what I did. I was using the warthog, the escort drone, and the stealth chopper. And I must say, my Warthog went off this game in about 10 seconds. You'll see a quad feed, and there's more quad feeds than ever. I've never seen a Warthog do so well. And I think that had to do with the, the fact that I was in this building this entire time. And I wasn't really letting them get out of their spawn. Um, also, in these challenges, I go in a full party because I'm trying to use really, really bad setups. You guys could probably uh, recommend a worse setup than this. Because I actually got this on my first game, and I didn't play I didn't play that well, in my opinion. But I did play pretty well. Um... But try to leave a harder, if you guys want to leave a harder setup than this, like um, I know a bunch of guys said get 100 plus going with the one man army where you run six perks, no gun, you pick up a gun and use that. I think that would really be a really good idea if you guys want to see the one man army, um, 100 plus, leave a comment. Also, another a lot of people said to go in a game, get try to get a nuclear 100 plus by switching out every single weapon after you get a kill. And that can be a problem sometimes because people don't drop weapons all the time in this game. So uh, it could be a little bit hard, but I'll, I'll give that a shot too later, um, probably later this week. So if you guys want to see those, make sure to drop comments. Also, leave a comment of what you guys want to see me use in one of these videos. This is the first ever subscriber challenge. I want to be a little bit more interactive with you guys. And I think this will be a little fun little series for you guys. I'll probably do this one, one or two times a week um, unless it really starts going. Unless it does really well, I'll, I'll try to do this four or five times a week. I think it'd be pretty fun. But um, anyways, guys, I just want to give you guys my thought processes. Thought process. Fuck me, dude. I've, I've done this commentary so many times. I'm not going to redo it. But I, I need to tell you guys my setup real quick, my class setup, what I was using, and then I'll talk about my thought process on, or my, my thoughts on pistols. Why am I saying thought process? But um, in, in this uh, gameplay, I'm using toughness with scavenger. I'm also using flat jacket, hardline, and dexterity. I'm running five perks. And I'm using C4 EMP grenades and a pistol. If I could have changed that one thing, I would have took off EMP and put on extended mags. But I did not have extended mags unlocked on this pistol class. So that's why I'm using EMP and just a pistol as my only gun. But um, also later in this gameplay, I pick up a SWAT because I ran out of ammo on this. And you'll see me get about 3, 4, 5 kills with it. I don't, I'm not too sure. But anyways, time to talk about pistols and if, if they're too strong or if they're not too strong and what's my opinion on them. Um, in my opinion, I think the Cat 40 and the B23Rs are way, way too good to be considered a secondary weapon. I think they're a pri they're just as good as a primary, in my opinion. And um, if you guys notice, there's a lot of snipers in this game. And the reason for that being is that the B23Rs and the Cat 40s, they're amazing secondaries. They're really, really strong secondaries. And what this allows is for a sniper to camp back there. And once you get close to them, they use fast hands and they switch to their pistol. And they absolutely light you up. And um, I think they're too strong. And I, I really wish they would have done pistols like they did in Black Ops 1. Where it was like one pistol that was semi-good, the Python. And the rest were just meh. They're just meh. And I really I really enjoyed that about Black Ops 1. Because you run out of ammo. You're fucked. You have to whip out the Python. You can only get one kill. And with these, with these pistols, you can get fucking triple feeds with one clip of them. And they're pretty, pretty fucking strong. And um, even in competitive play, I, I don't... I wish they were not in competitive play, in my my humble opinion. Cat 40s and B23Rs, if they were not in, if they were not in competitive, I would I would I would enjoy watching it more. Um, I was watching the COD Championships. I watch a lot of competitive Call of Duty. Um, you guys may think I don't, but I, I do watch it. I do play some um, when I'm not streaming. I don't I'm not into it like I could be, but I, I still do watch it. I still do play some. Um, I think it was the COD Championships where Parasite was using a sniper rifle, and when you think sniper rifle, you think stay back, hard scope, way in the back, and that's what he did. He was He's a really good sniper in competitive COD. He waits back, he gets a bunch of pickoffs, and the only bad thing is he uses a Cat 40 as his secondary, and you'd be crazy not to, but um, he actually got a 1v3, I think it was a 1v3 clutch with the Cat 40 with the sniper class, and it, you know, I think that the Cap 40 and the B23Rs, they add more mobility for snipers and guys with ARs just for the fact that, you know, a sniper is really good far away, but you get close to them, they just whip out that Cap 40 and they just light you up with the machine gun, uh, even though uh, they light you up even though you have an SMG. And I think the Cap 40 and the, I think the Cap 40 honestly destroys running a SMG in competitive play, and that's just my opinion. I don't think they should belong there. I think that if, you, if you're going to pick a sniper class, 
I feel that you should you should lose something, you know? You should lose being up close to somebody. In, in this game and with competitive COD the way it is, you don't lose anything if you pick a sniper class as long as you equip that Cat 40. But that's just my opinion. Hope you guys enjoy. Um, I'll see you guys. Oh, I might be streaming later tonight if you're still watching, but peace out, slow bags. Hope you enjoy the video.